welcome to the video tutorial of talk pedigree manager overview so in this video I'm just going to give you an overview of uh, what's uh, inside the talk pedigree manager and in the upcoming videos I'll go into them uh, into more details of uh, each of the layout and the uh, modules so first uh, let's uh, take a look at the layouts we have four different layouts and this is layout one as you can see next there is a uh, layout 2 layout 2 let's take a look at layout 3 so this is a uh, quite a bit different than uh, layout 1 and 2 let's take a look at layout 4 uh, this is a much uh, simpler layout okay only the dog photos and images and when you hover on them you can see the uh, more details about the dog so uh, let's take a look at the talks profile okay let's check out Bruce Two's profile so this is a dog profile uh, so there is the information about the dog uh, here you can uh, rate the dog the rating of the dog uh, there is uh, more details about the dog then there is the pedigree generation chart and as you can see the chart supports up to four generations and at the bottom you, uh, there is a comment box okay user can uh, log in and comment on talks now let's uh, check out the talks gallery okay uh, let's go to resource profile and as you can see under the photo uh, there is a uh, something called uh, a link called view gallery or you can just click on the dog image and it will take you to the gallery okay this is a dog's gallery as you can see it's a resource gallery and you can click on the next button to see the next image or you can just click on the image it will take you to the next image and also there is thumbnails here you can just uh, directly click on any of the thumbnails and it will load that image and the rating and also the comments okay and yeah users can log in and rate the dog or comment on the dog photo okay next uh, let's take a look at the dog breeds okay So uh, here is the dog breeds layout. Okay, we have a list of uh, more than uh, 400 dog breeds, and each of the uh, breed is uh, connected with Wikipedia. So when a user uh, clicks on a breed name, it will uh, load a dialog, and inside it will fetch more information from Wikipedia. And user can uh, read the information and close the dialog, and uh, just go ahead and click on another one and that's it uh, that's pretty simple and it is uh, grouped into alphabets so you can easily find wha what he or she is looking for next we have the dog names layout so in this layout we have uh, a list of uh, more than 4000 dog names and it is uh, listed alphabetically uh, there's the alphabet bar at the top uh, you can uh, click on any of the alphabets to load the list of the names that you start with that alphabet like uh, we have uh, clicked on N so it is uh, loading all the names uh, starting with N next we have uh, talk tips so talk tips uh, in talk tips it will uh, display a list of talk tips that we have uh, already uh, added in the database okay it, it, it all comes with the component itself but uh, yeah, in the admin area you will be able to uh, add as many talk tips as you want uh, we'll, we'll go into that details uh, in the upcoming videos so these are the basic layers and we also have uh, additional layers for users to add edit or delete talks and photos so for that you have to be logged in I am already logged in as the administrator so we'll now check out the my dogs layout okay so let's go to my dogs 
so here uh, it will lo load a list of uh, dogs uh, that the user has added okay so I have added all these dogs so uh, this uh, these are dogs that are showing up in this list so from here I'll be able to uh, view its profile view the gallery or I can edit the profile okay so let's uh, edit the profile of beer girl so to that to do that um, just click on edit profile and it will load up a form where you can select all the information uh, change all the information and just uh, click uh, submit to save it okay let's click on submit as you can see the doc profile updated successfully okay so you can click edit again to uh, edit uh, more more of the fields and you can also as you can see there is a tab called upload photos uh, from here a user will be able to change the profile photo or upload more gallery photos okay and I click the submit button and the photos will be uh, uploaded and I'll show all the details in the upcoming videos so similarly uh, there is a layout for adding dogs okay add dog is uh, similar to the edit dog okay the same form uh, you just uh, fill up on all the information okay select a dog father dog mother uh, and fill up uh, the required information and uh, click submit and it will submit the dog add the dog to the database so uh, that's it uh, for the overview of the dog pedigree manager and uh, I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching